Here we are in Premiere Pro separating the yellow to type in leave. So I'm going to select the taxi, which is yellow. You can see another yellow cab on the left. In Premiere Pro this is the video we're going to be using it is a yellow cab of course driving through New York City and what we're going to be doing is separating the yellow from the rest of the colors it's a very very simple effect let's get to it so first of all what you want to do is head over to the effects tab at the bottom left if you don't see it head over to window go down and you'll see effects if it still doesn't show up just go over to workspaces and select editing now, once you're on the effects tab, all you want to do is type in leave and under video effects, color correction, leave color. This is what we're going to be using. Simply drag and drop this onto your video. And this little section here is what we're going to be working with. So the amount to decolor is currently set to zero. We're going to change that to 100%. And then where it says color to leave, we're going to select the color picker and we're going to select the color we want obviously to leave. So I'm going to select the taxi, which is yellow. This is how it has turned out. Now, what we want to do is where it says match colors, change it from using RGB to using hue. Now we're almost done, not just yet. So if we go back, look over the video, see if there's anything else, you can see the orange is coming up on the uh, barricades here. So we're simply going to be changing this a bit more. Where it says tolerance, we're going to select the arrow and all we're going to do is bring this down just slightly. Now bear in mind you don't want to go too much because then you can see the cab also then starts to go a bit more grey. However then you've also got to balance this out as well. So it's probably best to keep going a bit lower. So we have got a slight bit of grey on the side of the cab. However if we play it through the rest of the cab seems to be quite good. And as you can see that's what we've done. So a slight bit of grey there, of course you can try and balance it out, it may be a bit difficult though. Now in some cases it would be easier to do this effect, it may be a bit harder, it just depends on the environment with the colour you're trying to use. Now bear in mind if you are trying to add on images into Premiere Pro, using this same effect does work as well using the exact same steps I've shown you. So once again just playing it through, final time, as you can see we've eliminated the other colours and we have kept the yellow. For example right here we've got the yellow cab. We've got the yellow lights, we've also got the yellow lorry back in there, or truck. And we'll play it through a bit more. You can see another yellow cab on the left. And there we go. And it's also picking up just very quickly on the side here. You can see it's like gold plated signs. So it does pick that up as well, which is pretty cool. But that's it. That is how simple it is to create a Sin City effect in Premiere Pro. It doesn't have to be yellow, it doesn't have to be red, it can be any colour you want to, just as long as you have one main colour in the video that you want to use.